good morning guys I am about to get on my treatment and uh, let me just say if I thought yesterday was hot today is even worse so I noticed last night that they issued a heat advisory for today last night so I was like oh great and it's currently 93 feels like 108 and yeah I don't want to sleep through going to the barn again so I'm gonna stay awake but um, summer I love it and I hate it at the same time but overall today <clears throat> doing pretty good um, just sat with a cup of coffee for about an hour and I'm gonna do my treatment and uh, just hang it out until uh, till about six so there's not a whole lot to report there's not a whole lot I'm doing today <laughs> tomorrow will be a little more interesting because I have my um, my dental appointment and I'm really excited this is gonna sound weird but I'm really really excited for that dental appointment because it is the final impressions so one it'll be quick and not painful and two it is the final step before I get the crowns on my implants and I got my implants put in uh, ten of them there's five up here and five down here um, September 7th of last year so it's almost been a year since that first initial surgery and then I had the second surgery to put the healing abutments on February 27th, I believe. Sometime, yeah, it was February 27th. So it has been six months since the second surgery. And I'm finally getting the final impressions tomorrow. And then it's just waiting for the crowns to come back. And I cannot wait. I am so excited. It has been a really long, really really hard process um but it is almost done and i'm so excited so i'm very excited for that appointment tomorrow and <clears throat> um, not so excited for the fact that i'll have to be sitting around tj maxx all day afterwards because the only way my mom can take me is by going to her work but you know it, it is what it is so um so i cannot wait for that so that'll be tomorrow tomorrow will be a little more interesting but i can tell you guys i've seen the dentist so many times that within the past year year and a half that i literally recognize everybody like the techs the dentists themselves like i will recognize them walking through the halls and like their names and everything that's how much i've been to the dentist uh within the past year and a half but anyway so that is tomorrow exciting even though it's kind of weird it's exciting the only unfortunate thing is i've been trying to catch the farrier um the past couple times I've been here and I'm like, oh, I should be able to catch the farrier tomorrow or catch the farrier this time while I'm here because I'm here three weeks. Well, the farrier is coming tomorrow. So unless he comes late in the evening, that's just my luck. But anyway, <clears throat> I'm going to hop on my treatment. So hope you guys are having a great day as well. And I'll see you guys in a little while. Hey guys, so I am currently on my way down to the barn and I'm pretty sure I just walked into a sauna. <sighs> It is 96, feels like 107, and um, guys, I don't remember it ever being this hot. Like, I know it's July in the south, and yeah, we get hot, but this is like our third or fourth day in a row with heat indexes over like 105, and we're already under a heat advisory for tomorrow. Now, I won't really be outside tomorrow, but still, it's like, come on now, killing me here. So, I don't know how much I'm going to actually do at the barn tonight, um, besides, like, maybe groom them and sit in the shade, and I, I, don't, I don't know, but, um, yeah, it is steamy. Actually, it looks like they're, uh, well, no, I thought they were eating, but maybe they are eating. Actually, it looks like they fed them, so I'll get down there and be able to say hi to him, uh, and then just hang out in the shade for a little bit, I guess. Probably a good thing. I don't think I need to actually be out here for two hours tonight because it's hot. So anyway, I'll see you guys when I get down there. I want to get down there before he starts um, letting them all out. Actually, I think he's coming right now. I see the gator. So, um, but yeah, gonna, gonna make the most of a hot July night. So they just got fed. So I'm actually walking to the back of the pasture, which is a relief because I can go get in the shade back there and stand with them. Um, but I can tell you guys that being down here tonight is 
a lot easier than it was on Mon or Sunday. <coughs> Lose track of my days. Um, it still hurts, but it's... I had, a, I had a bad light night last night. I was up crying half the night, but it's a lot better today. I'm enjoying being with, you know, with them and uh, not not feeling... <coughs> <laughs> so heavy hearted so I'm, I'm very thankful for that because uh, I like to enjoy this place you know it's, it's my place of happiness not sadness so um, I'm thankful but yeah I'm going to go take a cue from them and stand in the shade and uh, get out of the sun. It's actually labeled under um, dangerous heat is what they're calling it. So I have to be careful out here, but I already didn't go yesterday. I'm not gonna be able to go tomorrow. So hey girls and boy, um, I wanted to go tonight. So anyway, I'm gonna pay attention to where I'm walking because the ground is really uneven back here and my left ankle still doesn't appreciate being twisted, so. But just want to let you guys know that it is getting better. walked over here, which is part of the pasture, I don't, I'm not even sure I've ever been in before, it's the very border of it on this side. Not easy to get over here, let me tell you that, but it's in the shade, and there's a convenient log for me to sit on, so I'm digging it. Definitely no training happening tonight, that's for sure. But, uh, yeah, this is like, perfect. I'm already on my way home. I made it an hour, but too hot. I think if I stayed another hour, I'd probably end up collapsing with heat stroke. So, um, but I'm walking home. I'm gonna take a shower and do my treatment, and um, just gonna try and stay cool for the rest of the night and have a very early morning tomorrow. I have to be up by six. Um, to get ready to go to my dentist appointment. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here as I'm walking home. So it was good to hang out with them again. I actually felt happy. <laughs> I felt both. I felt happy and sad tonight, but I, I did feel happy, so that was good. And uh, it was nice. Slowly, slowly replacing the bad images in my head with good ones again. So with that, thank you guys so much for coming along on my day today, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.